Hey, welcome back guys. So today I'm going to take the drone out into this this public park. Quite a nice day out as well. There's a little bit of a breeze but it's also quiet. I only see like maybe three people sitting under the tree there. So uh, I'm going to focus mainly on doing manual mode today on the Avada and see how it goes. So let me quickly get set up in this this bench over here and then I'll take you through the steps. Be right back. So first off, uh, we're just going to start the drone in normal mode and uh, take off and then after that switch to manual mode. So again to start it up in manual mode, we will press down and inwards, that will start recording. Now from the goggles, what you want to do is to swipe forward, go to settings. And under controls, go to your controller, go to the bottom, under custom mode, you want to switch this to manual and it's going to ask you to confirm. And if you go back up, you go to gain and expo and make sure to have the attitude limit set off, otherwise you will not have full manual control of doing any flips and things like that. So just double tap on the pad with both fingers to go back. Okay, so a simple takeoff. So if you are a beginner and it's the first time that you'll be putting it into manual mode, what I suggest you do is to get about, let's say, 15 to 20 meters up in the sky. Click it into manual mode, follow the on-screen prompt, and off we go. I have to say I'm very very surprised that this little drone has so much power. Especially the, the fact that it's not really supposed to be a freestyle drone. Of course I'm not going to do anything crazy but the main purpose of the drone of course is for cinematics and things like that but just the fact that you can do manual mode on this drone makes it so much more fun. That's it from my side guys. Thank you so much for watching. Feel free to stick around for some aerial footage and I'll see you in the next one.